everyone. Welcome to Technical Linux. Um, this video will be, uh, I'll be dealing with the Nova Launcher Prime 2.2.3. This is the latest version of Nova Launcher Prime and it brings a lot of features that wasn't there in the previous version. So let's get started. You can see in the version of the launcher is 2.2.3. The new features that are added in the launcher is the scroll effect. The scroll effect are glass, wipe, zoom, fade, throw are the new ones. The glass which I am using right now is exactly equal and similar to the one that you can see in Samsung devices. This is known as the glass effect. And let me tell you that this is very smooth and fluent. You won't see any lag in the launcher. When you go in the app drawer, it gives you a similar Nexus style effect. And even you can customize your screen uh, scroll effect in the drawer as well from the option over here you can choose which option which uh, effect do you want to use in this in the drawer you can also select the background transparency of your drawer from the options you can also select which uh, style do you want to use we have three three type of options over here horizontal vertical continuous scroll up up and down and list the one thing which we are which we are missing in this which we are missing is uh, the vertical paginated we really miss that option but we hope that in the future options we'll get that the next thing that we that we that we get in the uh, dock option in this uh, new update is the dock style in the dock style you can choose which kind of style do you want to use like in the dock you will get this kind of tray type tray kind of thing and over that the icons will be placed you can also choose which color do you want to use and which pattern do you want to use from here you can access the patterns and from here you can access the color so all these uh, small tweaks add up to the user functionality and to the richness of the launcher the folders option remains more or less the same there are few more, few more other options like look and feel in the look and feel you can choose which kind of icons you want to use what are what will be the size of the icons the scroll speed animation speed app animations like in the app animation you can choose which kind of animation do you want to see like in jelly bean you can see uh, this kind of animation so when when you open some application like play store it opens up from one point to the whole screen but like when you choose ice cream sandwich it will be uh, it will be a different kind of animation which was present in the ice cream sandwich application uh, os like this kind of uh, transition so whichever you are comfortable with you can always choose the gestures and buttons deals with the gestures that you want to use you can select what kind of applications do you want to start when you do a particular gesture and uh, the hundreds count is one more added feature you can uh, place the hundred count over an application like gmail or email and you can configure this with the options given like large medium small so that whatever notifications are pending you can just see them from the application icon itself and this new apps icon new new apps uh, option is uh, something similar to that you get in the play store the play store do, does the similar thing and uh, I don't think we need it but then too it's an added feature the backup and import is a very user function uh, use user uh, uh, it's it's very user friendly because whenever you back up all the things like widgets and all and all the settings are backed up in the memory card and then when you will uh, install it once again like if you want to remove it you want to install you want to uh, format your mobile or something and uh, you you don't want your settings to lost you can back up the things and then you can restore and your launcher will be as it is as it was before and from here you can select default launcher say thanks to the developer if you want to and uh, that's it that's pretty much the launcher let me take uh, let me show you the once again the you have the launcher there's the widget section similar to the nexus and uh, as i told you there's no lag zero lag in the whole ui it's super smooth and super user friendly 
and this uh, there's also an option of infinite scroll in the options section so this was a uh, short review of the Nova Launcher Prime 2.2.3. If you like this video, please click thumbs up and subscribe the button down below. Um, please subscribe for more videos. Uh, there are great videos coming up and uh, hope to see you in the next video. Thank you.